As a nurse, we get to get in personal with patients, especially in the intake process when we ask certain questions, such as, have you ever lived or worked in a prison or a jail? And we ask these questions for various reasons, mainly for testing purposes, such as TB. I know for 100% certainty that that question is on a TB questionnaire or an intake uh, for an intake. In any case, once I hear the answer to that question, I drop it at all costs. I go ahead and drop it. Some nurses, and if you say you've never Googled a patient's name and you're a nurse, you're either lying to me or you're brand new at nursing. Some nurses go ahead and Google the person's name. HIPAA violation? Probably, but everybody's done it. They Google it and they figure out exactly what it is that that person did to get the criminal history that they had to answer on that background check or that TB check, I should say. Now, once they find out these other nurses may or may not judge them according to how they feel. Now, I cannot, and I know this for 100% certainty, I cannot know what you went to jail for because the moment that I find out that you went to jail for something that I wholeheartedly disagree with, I'm going to judge you. You're going to be last on my list for pain meds. Care is going to decline drastically. Yes, I'm gonna go ahead and tell you right now. I'm gonna judge you as soon as I figure out what it is you went to jail for. So in order for me to do a better job in nursing, to do a non-biased job in nursing, to not be uh, so judgmental, it is so much better for me as a nurse to not know what it is that you went to jail for. Don't care if it's felony misdemeanor. You tell me you went to prison and I'm dropping all of those questions. Because as soon as I figure out what it is, I'd, I go ahead and treat you differently. I do. Therefore, I don't know. I don't, and it's good for me that way. If I see a patient that comes in with a guard, it happens. Patients do come in with uh, police escorts or guard escorts at times. Once I see that again, I do not ask questions because it's better for me. And if you go ahead and tell me that I'm wrong for doing so, and yes, I am wrong for doing so, how many of you would do the same thing as soon as you figure out what someone went to jail for? <sighs> right or wrong, it's better for me to not know. So I do not judge someone based upon past events. All I need to look at them is, as a patient that needs cared for, not as criminal history X. <sighs> Yes, go ahead and let you know, I do judge as soon as I figure it out, I do. <sighs> if you do or do not, let me know down below. Do you like to know what someone did in their history? Don't, do not give me examples. Do not give me examples of patient did X, Y, Z. You're very close to violating HIPAA when you do something like that, so don't do that. But I just can't know. If you can or cannot, let me know down below, curious. Hope it helps. Thank you much.